In assembly weldments, you create assemblies, prepare models for welds, add the welds, and then add more assembly features for the final machining operations. Once the weldment model is complete, all parts and features are saved to a single assembly file called a weldment. Machining displays assembly features that represent post-weld machining and finishing operations. To activate machining, either click machining in the process panel of the ribbon or double-click the machining folder in the browser. Once the machining environment is active, the commands in the preparation and machining panel are available. In the case of this assembly, after the welding is complete, we need a flat on the shaft that is located relative to the ribs of the Spider-1 component. Right-click on Work Plane 1 in the browser and select New Sketch from the context menu. The sketch orients itself to the plan view. Press F7 to slice the graphics. All the normal sketch commands are available to you for sketching. Project the bottom and left edge of the shaft. Draw a rectangle with the left edge collinear to the projected line. Right click in the window and select the two point rectangle. Click the left projected edge near the bottom edge and drag up and to the right. Type 2, press Tab, and type 8, then press Enter. Dimension the bottom of the rectangle 5 mm from the bottom of the end of the shaft. Finish the sketch, and on the ribbon, Weld tab, Preparation and Machining panel, click Extrude. The only closed loop available is selected. Notice that the only operation available in the Extrude dialog box is Cut. Machining operations are material removal operations only. Note that all the sketched feature commands available in the Preparations and Machinings panel are material removal commands. The Extrude, Revolve, and Sweep commands only allow a cut operation, but other than that, the process is the same as the normal feature, including the dialog boxes. Change the extents to all, the direction to symmetric, and click OK to create the flat. Click the Return button on the Return panel, or right-click and select Finish Edit from the Marking menu. Right-click Weld Post 1, and select Open from the Marking menu. Notice that there is no flat on the part. Machining features do not modify the part file so that the proper workflow documentation can be created. A component or multiple components may need to be machined after welding to take into account the warp of a material due to the welding process or if the feature needs a specific alignment of components. This capability provides for the creation of that documentation from a single assembly.